plein air frames are our most popular style of frames that we carry. The timeless classic quality of the plein air frames are created with ultra sturdy construction. It's solid wood and then they actually gesso over it so that the frames are smooth and beautiful and reflect light nicely. Five elegant colors are included in the plein air frames collection. We've got a matte black, we've got a beautiful mahogany, there is the matte white that gives kind of that clean, crisp, modern look. And then we have two hand gilded selections, gold and then silver that are also antiqued. So out of those five selections, you can find a frame that's going to fit any style of artwork, whether it's something that's more modern like watercolor on Yupo, whether it's perhaps mixed media, whether it's a very classically rendered drawing, even just graphite pencil or oil paint or a very loose acrylic. There's something in this selection of frames in this beautiful collection that will work for you and enhance your artwork. Plain air frames have a really nice, thick, wide, classic three inch depth to the molding on the face. This gives a very nice, clean framed appearance. It's very nice weighted, it looks very much like a museum piece when you framed your artwork with it. As far as framing goes, I know we're not all framers and maybe nobody's ever showed us how to do it before, but let me show you just how easy it is to work with these plein air frames. The plein air frames come with hardware. It's D-rings and screws to put them in, and then you just need to select what type of wire is best for the weight of your work. The rabbit which is that indentation in the frame that your artwork is going to sit, is a half inch deep. What this allows you to put in is glass, matted artwork like prints or watercolors, drawings, etc., and foam backing. It also allows you to put in uh, panels, whether it's a canvas panel, I've got an aluminum panel that we're going to use here to frame with, um, and foam core. And then you can actually put up to a three quarter inch canvas in the back with a quarter inch offset clip. And we'll show you how that works in a minute. So I've got an oil painting here that's done on aluminum. So all we're going to do is invert that, slide that into the rabbit. And you can see that this is, has a lot of fingerprints. Just to give a very clean, beautiful presentation to the back, I'm putting in acid-free black foam core so this matches up very nicely with the black of the frame. It's a nice clean presentation. I don't have to paper the back if I don't want to. So all we're going to do is hold this down. I have a point driver here. And it's got flexible points so I can easily take this back out later. nice, clean presentation of an oil painting. Now we're going to show how to do a framing with a three quarter inch canvas and we'll put the hardware on. All right, so now I've got a frame and we're using a three quarter inch canvas. Got that down in the rabbit. Just going to push that in. These are a quarter inch offset. So what that does is gives a quarter inch either rise or drop to be able to put something slightly deeper than that rabbit in or slightly shallower than that rabbit if you don't have a point driver. So here is our finished three quarter inch canvas in the frame. So we've shown you how a point driver works with flat artwork, uh, panels or 
you know, matted artwork with glass and backing. We've shown you with a three quarter inch canvas. Now let's go back and we'll show you how to actually install the hardware that comes with your frame. All right, so included with your frame are two D rings with the screws to put them in. So this is how you would actually put them on your piece. So now we've got our hardware installed that comes with the plain air frame. All you need to do from here is decide what gauge wire is going to work best for the weight of your artwork that you've got. And then you install that. If you're not really sure what's gonna be best, you can either reach out to customer service by phone or by email and ask them for some advice or consult one of our friendly Jerry's Artorama frame shops. So we've got that all done. We've got a beautiful piece in a beautiful frame and we're ready for the gallery.